We believe Egypt should remain a civil state and therefore the liberal secular movement must have some kind of a party or a gathering to uh, fight this tendency and to ensure that uh, Egypt remains as a civil and secular state. Uh, and therefore we decided to make the party to make some balance in this uh, coming election. Mr. Bessel seems to be pretty worried about uh, his uh, uh, Muslim brotherhood. I mean, it's, 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 you don't know what kind of party is going to be, how moderate it's going to be. We are also very worried, so that's why we made the party, you know, and we hope that the next election will be more balanced and uh, we will be given time to uh, avoid this. Uh... Also, about, um, also about your investments, well, in Egypt, for, I mean, in the, next, in the next few months, do you think with the next election, with a different situation, Egypt could actually attract more investments? For I, I think uh, not in the next two months, you know, I think we still have to, most investors will wait to see the election and what kind of stable system they're going to be in Egypt uh, before uh, they invest. This is the, unfortunately the truth, but we made the revolution, you know, it takes time for, after the revolution to come to stability, you know. I still believe Italy is the best place uh, in Europe to invest, uh, even this weakness in the economy, it, it creates uh, opportunities. On the stand of wind, we are inter interested and keen to consolidate our position in the telecom market uh, here. So we are looking at all the options uh, on the table. And me personally, I retain the ownership of Libero and the international traffic. And I will continue to also uh, grow these two businesses organically and also by looking at other entities that could be joined uh, with me. You know, are you going, are you ready to spin off? How, when are you going to spin off your activities in, um, actually, in Egypt? We are waiting. Uh, the problem is the local authorities, the regulator and so on, they are very slow. And now everybody in Egypt is very shaking to sign anything. So it's not a good situation.